Let's start simple. Einstein's theory of relativity, special relativity, special relativity, says two key things. The laws of physics are the same for everyone, no matter how fast you're moving. It's constant, even if you're moving toward or away from it. But here's where it gets weird. Because light speed must stay the same, space and time must adjust to make it work. That means if you're moving really fast, close to the speed of light time actually slows down for you compared to someone standing still. This isn't just theory. We've proven it. Here's a real world example. Astronauts aboard the International Space Station experience time a bit more slowly than we do on Earth because they're moving fast. It's tiny milliseconds, but measurable. In fact, a 2010 experiment by NASA using ultra-precise atomic clocks showed that clocks on high-speed planes ticked slower than identical clocks on the ground. Imagine you take a spaceship and travel at near light speed for five years. You return to Earth. Maybe 50 years have passed here. To you, only five years went by. To Earth, you were gone for decades. It's time dilation. So what does it mean that time is relative? It means there is no universal now. Your present might not match someone else's S if they were moving fast enough or sitting near a massive object. This also happens in general relativity where gravity warps time. Time literally moves slower near massive bodies like black holes. So here's the big question. If time changes depending on speed and gravity, is it even real? Or is it just something humans invented to make sense of events? Some physicists argue that time as we experience it past, present, future is an illusion. In a 2016 article published in Scientific American, theoretical physicist Carlo Rovelli writes, the flow of time is a mental process, not a feature of physical reality. Rovelli's theory of loop quantum gravity suggests that at the deepest level, the universe is a network of events, but not ordered in time. There is no tick-tock at the quantum level. Events just happened, and before and after may be illusions created by our brains to understand causality. So maybe we don't move through time. Maybe time is something our minds create. To survive? So the next time you check the clock, ask yourself, is this real or just a story we've all agreed on? Einstein shattered our view of time, but philosophers and scientists are still arguing about what it really means. One thing is certain, the universe is far stranger than it seems. Leave a comment below. Do you think time is real or just an illusion? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and take your time.